So these nerves have to come off of the spinal cord and then they have to travel through different pathways, through muscles, in between muscles, sometimes through uh, what's called the fibro-osseous tunnel uh, in order to reach the skin. That means that along those paths, you can have different points where there could be compression or friction. And so what we see is that when you bend forward, the space between the outer part of the nerve, basically in the butt, and the spinal cord, that distance increases. And so you can actually have a lengthening of the nerve, which is normal, but if that nerve is inflamed, then you can actually end up with more pain because that stretch on the nerve that's already inflamed causes more inflammation and more pain. And then when we go into extension or basically arching the back and kind of looking upwards, you can have compression of the muscles because the muscles of the low back need to, need to flex and contract in order to do that movement. What happens is that flexion and contraction of those muscles can actually pinch on nerves as the nerves are either passing in between two muscles or actually through one of the muscles. That compression can therefore cause additional pain, which can therefore result in you not being able to do those movements.